We're here at the St. Louis Aquarium. It is the newest aquarium in the world. This place is amazing. It's in the Union Station, which was an old train station in downtown St. Louis. And you have the Ferris wheel back there. You got carousel rides, big lake here. And then right here at Union Station, you have the aquarium. And also inside this all, there is uh, like a hotel and ballrooms and all sorts of stuff. This is an awesome place to come, not just for the aquarium, but a whole bunch of other stuff. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? We just made it past the first line. We are going inside for our amazing first picture. They said I can take as many pictures as I like, which is great, because I'm gonna take a lot of pictures. final holding room where you wait to get your tickets checked one last time. They basically have restrooms and then it's built like a train station. So there's these signs that say two trains and because we actually are in an old train station it's really cool. And then of course there's the train station clock. But this clock is an aquarium and is full of discus fish so it's actually not a saltwater aquarium. And then the ceiling, the ceiling looks like space. It just has stuff flying around it. Oh, is there actual trains? Looks like there's actual... Oh, no, it just looks like trains. Wow. We are in a train station. It's a video room? What is this? Oh, man. Uh oh. Uh oh. Our train's flying. Whoa. I think we're gonna go underwater. We're not going under. Oh, we are going under. Catfish, walleye, bluegill, drumfish. Uh oh. Uh oh. Anyone of back at the train station. Have a wonderful day at the St. Louis Aquarium. And Yeehaw! We're under the water. Right behind me is the piranha tank. And what you'll notice is all the piranhas are the same size because if they're actually different size, they'll gang up and attack the smaller ones and kill them. But since this is a brand new aquarium, the, uh, the piranhas are actually all rather small compared to what you've seen in some other places. So over time, the stock of aquariums at Piranha Watch again. Piranhas at Aquarium Watch are getting quite large. But these guys, they're hungry. Look at them. So we're in the second room. The first room had a lot of the paddlefish and Missouri fish. And now we've got piranhas and some other South American fish. And now we are looking at river otters. Uh, there's river otters over there. And then there's like a sand pit where you can play uh, with some sand. And then there's also a little video that teaches you about otters, which I'm probably not going to watch.
many aquariums have their own ropes course. These are crazy. Ropes course, touch tanks, water pools, and of course, there is Stanley. Lord Stanley's a lobster, which was a blue lobster donated uh, by a restaurant in Boston to St. Louis after the St. Louis Blues beat the Boston Bruins. We found Nemo. I repeat, we found Nemo. Look right here. Clownfish in here. And they are getting this tank set up. Remember, this is a brand new aquarium. Uh, so they're just getting the tank set up. Looks like they might have some sort of interesting reef rock in here. And of course, they've got some zoas uh, getting ready to grow out. So they're starting their mushroom grow out. So if you've got any mushrooms to donate to the St. Louis Aquarium, looks like they're starting to collect some. So this aquarium not only has a ropes course, here's Shark Cannon and right above Shark Cannon are actual hotel rooms. So you can basically stay in a train station that's also an aquarium slash ropes course slash carnival place slash hotel. We're about to go into Shark Canyon. I'm very scared right now. Who knows what we'll see. What do you see, John? There's a big shark over here. Oh my gosh. Fish right up here. Oh my gosh, is he gonna eat us? <laughs> Quick, feed him a carrot. It's about to get real. The shark tank is almost upon us. Here's the view into the shark tank. Look at this guy. He's coming right for us. He's coming right for us. There's lots of opportunities to be underneath the water. This has been the most crazy, most busy aquarium experience ever. Uh, but we did it. And we're outside of the aquarium. Unfortunately, cool things like the ropes course was not included, but that looks like a lot of fun. There's actually people zip lining around this building. And right now I'm gonna go grab some lunch. So thank you very much for joining me on this episode of Up Daddy Reef. This is your official PDR tour of the St. Louis Aquarium, the world's newest aquarium for now. So we think we might have hit a million views on the channel. So I'm gonna go into my analytics here, click lifetime, and we're gonna see if we hit a million views. One million, four thousand six hundred seven views. Woo! I'd like to thank all my viewers for watching Puff Daddy Reef. It's been a wild ride. We started September 14th of 20, 13 and now it is 2020 so not quite seven years later but we've hit a million views so thank you very much keep watching puff daddy Reed. <laughs>